New tonight, the federal government shut down a Texas trucking company whose only driver faces charges in the killing of a Loudoun County deputy. It says the company poses an imminent hazard to public safety. 10 News investigator reporter Cole Sullivan joins us with the allegations facing that company. Cole. John, the Department of Transportation says Texas based Coboat Trucking took no action to make sure its only driver was eligible to be behind the wheel of a big rig. THP says he was high on marijuana when he crashed into Loudoun County Sergeant Chris Jenkins, killing him. It says the company exercised virtually no oversight over its drivers or vehicles and thus abdicated all responsibility for safety. The DOT says if it did take some oversight, it would have known that driver Christopher Savannah was not properly licensed. The owner of the trucking company told me last month his was a one truck operation. So sorry for uh, the, uh, the negligence of the driver. Okay. And uh, I'm also crying here for the family and I'm greeting with them as well. The federal order means that owner can't just change the name of the company and keep operating, but he can apply to have the order rescinded. If the company was to do that, there are a series of safety steps it must first take. Back to you. Cole Sullivan on the update. Thank you.